and welcome to Fool the Humans Super Mario 64 speed run. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> yeah, so we've been doing uh, a Mario 64 playthrough as like a regular weekly uh, thing on our channel. And uh, when we started doing that, uh, I got really curious and I've always been fascinated by speed runs. So I actually learned how to do uh, this a 16 star speed run of Mario 64, and it's something that I've been practicing probably the last couple of months. And I'm still like, you know, there's people out there that can, you know, do the thing in 16 minutes and are amazing. And I'm nowhere near that talented, but I am actually able to complete the speed run, which is something that I'm proud of. So uh, today we're going to take a crack at it and see how fast I can do it. Um, and I'm kicking myself because I did a practice run earlier today that I think may have been my fastest time that I've ever gotten. But uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll see how I do. I believe in you. <laughs> Ready to go? Yep. All right. Timer's going. Game reset. Mario, please come to the castle. I've baked a cake for you. Here's truly Princess Toad Peach. <laughs> I've grown to hate this intro. I'm sure. Because it's just like, it's it feels like ages before you can actually do anything. <laughs> so which one are you going for again? I wasn't listening it, while you it's, were talking. It's 16 <laughs> stars. It's the one that I've already, that I've, okay. you've seen me do. I couldn't remember... Yeah, I, I'm. I, I've probably changed up a few things that I do since you last saw me attempt to do it. But um, yeah, it's just a 16 star run. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, and I think there's a there's a one star run and then a 70 star run, and then there's some people who speed run all 120 stars, it's which is insane. I mean, yeah. what does the speed run for that even look like? Uh, it's, I, I can't remember what the record is, but it's, it's many, many hours. I'm sure. It's basically somebody 100%ing the game as fast as they humanly can, which is just absurd. Right. I love doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Just long jumping into the Doink. Yeah, so my first star I it's not a very fast star. There's way faster ways to do this, but I usually do King Babom at the top of the mountain. Mm, right. I think I get a I get three stars from this level. Um I get King Babom, I get the star on the floating island and I get the chain chomp one those are the three I go for I used to uh, do the uh, the Koopa race as well but that's super time consuming because even if you get up there super fast, you still have to wait for him to finish the race. So you just end up standing there for, like, 20 seconds right. doing, like, nothing. I, I think this one goes a lot better. Also, I love this guy's mustache. Right. These mustache bulls. Alright, first star down. Yes, yes. Dialogue boxes. Go away. The bane of your speedrun existence. Pretty much. Come on. It's just like running up next to him, punching at him like, come on, come here. Poof, poof, yeah. poof. Cool, I don't need to know how the cannon works. 
I just need to get in it. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the fence. <laughs> it's fine. Second star down. Yep. Uh, now I just got to get the chain shop one. Uh, there's a, there's actually a glitch for that star that's usually, usually people only get the chain shop star on this level and they use uh, the bomb clip or some people call it clippy. Um, mm -hmm. But I haven't, I, I've never, I haven't successfully done it before. I've gotten the glitch to work, but I haven't used it to get into the cage. Right. I missed. Come on. There we go. I mean, and even without the glitch, like, for a beginner, like, this is a quick star anyways, so. Yeah, it's really not too bad time-wise. All right, and I am all done with Bomb Bomb Battlefield. All right, only 13 bells to go. Stars. I mean, stars. I've obviously <laughs> been playing too much Animal Crossing. <laughs> like this video if you want to see me play Animal Crossing in a stream or something. <laughs> it's not super fascinating. It really isn't. It's fun to play, but man, is it, it can be mind-numbing. It's, it's too zen of a game. I say that, but, like, the reason I got it was because I was watching other people stream it, so. Yeah. Let me put it this way. I don't think I could be interesting while streaming it, because it's very much the game I play when I want to escape the world. Right. And just, like, not think about everything going on in life. Alright, so we're going to get a couple of stars on this level, but I'm going to get this one first. Missed it. Oh. Nice. I just get that one first because I use the tree to save a lot of time and on later stars the the owl comes out of the tree and uses up a lot of time. Mm. There's also like a bunch of ways to like skip and get to the top really fast, but I'm not I've not good at those. So Oh, I saved it and then fucked it up. <laughs> that was so I like held my breath for that. I wasn't saying anything because I just was like Ugh. Yeah. That's alright. There, there we go. go. Time to take on King Thwomp. Which, which there's a fun. You can actually jump oh. through his body. That's cool. I don't think I'd ever seen you do that before. Yeah, that's something kind of new that I picked up. Which, you know, it doesn't. You know, it saves. A couple of seconds but it's not a huge time saver but it is just kind of a fun thing you can do yeah all right time to go to the top of the fortress is pretty much the same strategy as going after the thwomp let's just run up here <laughs> try not to mess up this jump <laughs> so we've actually recorded quite a few of these um this will probably be the first one we're uploading nice yeah, um something i've been practicing <laughs> 
Oh, <laughs> oh man. Uh, Jesus. Oh. There we go. I'll do it right. <laughs> I'll be patient this time. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's because I'm recording, so now I got a flub. All right, of course. Because you only flub when we're recording. Yep. Otherwise, perfectly perfect in every way. Pretty much. Woohoo, I'm an owl. Oh no! It's all right. Thought you had it. I'll get the, I'll get the star and then try again. Very nice. I thought I was going to miss it. <laughs> Not going to lie. I thought I had shot too low. You're just, you're just giving me so much anxiety. On yeah, this you know. I gotta put on a show. <laughs> All right, let's, let's try the cage again. This is actually what happened during my practice run. Is I I messed it up the first time and had to do substitute the mm. cannon shot in. There we go. Nice. It's like one of those things where it's like as soon as you let go is when the the sat shadow will sh show up. And you mm. basically know immediately whether or not you landed it. Gotcha. Alright, so we're all done here. Off to, uh... I forget what this world is called. The snow level. Cool, cool mountain. Mm, cool. All right. Got a couple of stars to get here. Going to do the slide. I think the next one is the baby penguin one. <laughs> Poor baby penguin. It's been thrown off by small children for its entire existence. Come here. Damn it. Oh, no. <laughs> so close. Uh, it's all right. I'm still fine tuning that one. I'm trying to get it so I can guarantee it every time. Mm. Like that. Very nice. Alright, and then I'm 
going to do the penguin race. And I've got one more after this star. Sorry, I shouldn't sing along. It's <laughs> Again, I just hear Lon Lon Ranch music. I, I don't hear it, but I, I, I comment, believe you, but I don't hear it. Comment below if you also hear the race music from Lon Lon Ranch. Viewers. Come on. Cool, that's great. Coins. <laughs> Don't care. I really hope they... Like, I really want to play Super Mario Sunshine, like, for the channel, but I keep seeing all these rumors that they're going to remaster it, and part of me is just like... I don't... I'd rather play a beautiful remastered version. Where the fuck are you going? Oh. Star. Ooh. Bounced a little bit. That's fine. A little easier to consistently do instead of jumping off and trying to air yeah, kick yeah, my yeah. way in. Well, good job. All right. 12 stars done. I am done with the lobby. So now it's time for the first Bowser fight. Nice. Do do do. But yeah, I really I really hope they either remaster or give us a sequel to Sunshine. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. I wouldn't mind playing that myself. It's my favorite. Well, that and Odyssey. Odyssey is pretty good. Although, if I'm being honest, I think Odyssey is, like, second, and my absolute favorite is Sunshine. It's probably... I mean, at this point, it's and I, like it's a really weird love-hate relationship, but 64, I think, is my favorite Mario game. Right. And I think it's just like partially Stockholm syndrome because I've invested <laughs> so much time right. into it. Kind of the way I feel about Sonic Adventure, to be honest. <laughs> Sonic Adventure 2. I haven't played all of Sonic Adventure yet, but um, Sonic Adventure 2, I'm like, I love this game so much, but do I really love this game that much? Like, I'm aware it's not that good a game. Not what I want to do. Hey! <laughs> so usually, for, for the first two Bowser fights, if you screw up your first throw if you do it if you don't do a full throw and you do short one you can at least get them closer to the bomb right all right on to the basement i need like i need you to edit like a the dun dun from like Majora's Mask and have it like four stars remain. <laughs> Majora's Mask, another game I'll love to play for the. We haven't started, I just realized we haven't done a Zelda series. 
Yeah, I really want to. Yeah. We might have to do some trade-offs on yeah. uh, who plays what Zelda game, because we both love them so much. It was on Wind Waker. Fine. <laughs> You get Wind Waker, I get Ocarina. Deal. Wind Waker is probably one of my favorites. If not my favorite. I'm also partial to Majora's Mask and uh, Skyward Sword. And parts of Twilight. Like, I like Twilight Princess. It's just so long. Like, it feels longer than the other Zeldas to me for some reason. And it, it might, might be. Here you go. Oh, couldn't do it. <laughs> Here you go, Mario. Do, do the void. Jump into the void. No, you want to. I do really don't. <laughs> Fucking... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it, it, when our let's play gets up to date you'll see how much I really abhor that level <laughs> alright and I think we're going to try and get this video out today right yeah that's the plan because yeah. I gotta edit for the Mario let's play anyways so I might as well do this yeah, this will be an easy one. Just a quick cut and chop. Oh. A little bit of hack and slash. Alright, 15 stars. Time for Mips Clip. Mips, Mips, Mips. Just gotta find the little bastard. <laughs> Oh, he looks so sad and defeated. Yeah, because I think the whole thing is like, is that like Bowser forced him and he's like ashamed to have participated in it. Damn it. It's such like a delicate man. Yeah, it seems it's really touchy. Come on. Damn it. I can't, why do I keep it? I've never hit the wall before. I know. This and is now I'm now all I can do is punch the wall. Usually you get this one pretty quick. I, I got it, but I didn't do it in any way that I usually have done it before. <laughs> That's weird. I didn't know he automatically let go of Mips when you crouch. Got that one first try, though. <laughs> yeah. Good job. Ugh. All right. Bowser sub. Beloved water levels. 
I I mean, yeah, I did I did lose it on this one a little bit when we were getting oh, okay. the actual stars. Mm-hmm. There was uh some shit went down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Some abuse was hurled. Oh no, and now I'm now I'm remembering how our recording last night ended. Yeah, some major shit went down. Yeah. <laughs> I I think I blocked that out. <laughs> I almost completely forgot about that. Who? It's fine. Sixteen stars, baby. Yep. Now I just gotta fight this Bowser and then get final Bowser. You can do it. I mean, at this point, it's not really a question of whether or not I can do it. It's just how quickly can I do it. <laughs> Please stop. I'll take it. Watching your, you yeet yourself through these levels always impresses me. Yeah? Like on a platformer level. I'm just like, this is impressive. Yeeting. Yeah. I, I, Especially because, I don't know, maybe this isn't true, but I feel like I'm the more platformery one. I, like I tend to play more than you. Yeah, I, I think you've played more platformers in your life than I have. Yeah. But I, I don't know. I've just, I've gotten to a place with Mario where it's like, it's becoming second nature. Mm. Woo -hoo! I like how you like saved that and then immediately burnt your ass anyway. Well, I had a lot of momentum going. It was kind of hard to. Right. Bowser number two. Yep. Really? Stop it. Bowser's so rude. He really is. Is that close enough? Nope. It's alright, he spawns close to the edge. Damn it. I feel like the final Bowser bombs are on a different hitbox. <laughs> I think the hitbox is slightly different and they're farther away from the actual platform. So you actually mm. have to do a full throw. You can't just softball them into it. Well, I also feel like width-wise, like from the sides of it. Yeah, I feel like the first two are very more forgiving. Yeah, exactly. I'm just like, they just kind of let you do that. All right. Another one I've been thinking about is Luigi's Mansion. I've never played. It's fun. The first, I really like the first one. I'm not a as big a fan of the second. I feel like the first one... Oh, let me put it this way. The second is a little more kid-friendly scary. 
Whereas the first one was actually kind of fucked up. close on that last one. Not enough. I love when the momentum is too much and he, like, sides up against the wall. Yeah. That always, that always brings me a little joy to my heart. So anyway, I think I would do, like, Luigi 1, maybe skip 2, and then do the 3rd, because I've heard good things about the 3rd, but I haven't played it at all yet. Oh. oh, I had it. I just didn't... I wasn't aimed at the door. There it is. Nice. I just gotta do it again. This one's easier though. Yeah. Cause you don't have you have an infinite runway. First try. Nice. <laughs> this is the one of you like fucking up five times and then immediately getting it. This like on the first try in a second area. Pretty much. I'm also, I'm getting better at timing it. Like, I know what the rhythm is supposed to be for it. Mm. Which... Oh, that rhythm game you've been playing. What's it called again? Muse Dash? Yeah, Muse Dash. I'm a, I'm a fan. Come on. When in doubt, side flip. Pretty much. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's you another. Learned so many new like <laughs> flips and tricks. Very nice, man. All right. I remember when you used to have trouble, like, getting here. Yeah. Now now the stages are just, like, nothing to me. <laughs> like, I, I just don't even think about it anymore. Right. Really, it's just, it's just the glitches and the Bowser fights are the things that stress me out the most. Hello, gay Bowser. Got it. So long, gay Bowser. Nope. Uh, see, I feel like that would have hit on the first two. Nope. 
Come on. That's a hit. Nice. Nope. Too far out. Nope. Yeah, this is where I always have the most trouble, I think, is getting... Yeah, it's this last fight. That's, please, yes. Yes, nice! Wow, I love how we just were like, yeah, this is a hard one for you. <laughs> and then it's like, never mind. Does it immediately. Thirty-four fifty-two. Nice. So my practice run earlier today was like thirty-four twenty area, mm -hmm. but I'll take a thirty-four, just sub thirty-five. I'm happy with that. Yeah. Yeah. This is like one of the cleanest runs I've done in a while. That was that was really good. There Woo! are a couple spots, but you know what? Yeah. Fuck it. Good enough. Yeah, Mario, get that Princess Peach kiss. Uh, uh. Woo. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How do you feel? Uh, pretty good. I'm I'm gonna do a stress test on my phone <laughs> to see if I'm if that spiked anything. Right. Just because I'm interested to see. <laughs> oh god what is it uh i'll send it to you uh, I, I i apparently i maxed out the oh god i can't even read your stress which honestly my bpm is not that bad it's 107 which is just slightly above, like, what <laughs> resting, what, around the resting area, so. But yeah, maybe I'll, maybe I'll add that in the video, but yeah, I, I took, I, I took a, I have a Samsung phone, and they have the Samsung Health, and they have a stress test, and it measures your, your beats per minute, and then, I guess, the moisture content of your skin. Um, and so it's 107 BPM and 99% moisture content. And just like, it just says my stress and then all the way at the high end of the spectrum. It's pretty hilarious. Not going to lie. God, that freaking eel, man. I hate that eel so much. Like, I feel like after this game, they made all the enemies kind of cute. But in this one, they were like, no, let's make that eel look like a fucking monster. Oh, it was also like, it was like probably one of the first times i'm working with 3d and it's like they're not even working with like proper 3d modeling software like they actually had to like code the shapes yeah so it's and like they also had to like <laughs> it was just like well i hope this texture looks okay yeah it's like you, it was like one of those things where they had to code and compile it and run it before they could see the result <laughs> whereas like now with like 3d modeling like you can see a pre-render as you're working yeah yeah that shark is also disturbing that manta ray is a little disturbing it's more the eyes like they need to shrink the eyes a little or do something different with the eyeballs but uh yeah so that's that's my 16 star speed run uh i'm pretty happy with that time uh considering my very first completed speed run was 
at like 56 minutes or something like yeah. that. So I've essentially cut 20 minutes off of my time uh, through practicing. So I'm 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 happy with that. Yeah. So uh, if you like this video and you want to check out more stuff that we do, uh, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. We've got a Mario Let's Play uh, that comes out every Monday. Uh, we're working our way towards getting 120 stars. Uh, yeah. And I'm playing that and Z is watching. And then Z is playing uh, Sonic, Sonic Adventure, Adventure 2. 2. And that comes out on Sundays, right? Or Saturdays. 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 So it's Sonic Saturday and Mario Monday. Yeah, so um, that comes out every Saturday. And uh, if you like Sonic Adventure 2 and there's a certain chow you'd like me to breed, I am uh, taking commissions. <laughs> sounds about um, right. Or I might just do what I want. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Yeah. But we'll also be having other random content come out throughout the week. Um, yeah. Expanding and... more than just gaming videos and stuff but, but thank you for watching yeah. <laughs>